What's up, Christine? Let's go and take a look at this push press, power jerk, and split jerk combo. Really good push press so far. Good jerk. So still need to work on that press out. It needs to be faster, snappier. And good split jerk. Much better job on that split jerk. That looked good. Much better work, footwork on your split jerk. That's for sure. I can tell right away. So let's go and take a look at your push press first. Let's slow it down. So good dip. As you can see, the heels are rolling forward. Okay, so we're going to keep those heels down. Wear your weightlifting shoes if you have to. I'm not sure if you're wearing... I think you're wearing your regulars here, your flats. Oops. Sorry, I did not go back far enough. So push press first. Sorry. Push press. So slight roll forward wasn't too bad. So it looks like on the jerk you roll forward more. So that was a good push press right here. And now let's go and skip forward to your jerk. And like I said, when I first watched it right here, see there's a lot of gap going on right here underneath their heels. We want to keep the heels down. Remember, the weight doesn't have to be on the heels. It just has to be over midfoot with your all the points of contact on the feet on the floor. Good follow through. Good drive underneath. I would like to see more aggressive drive underneath. So right here to here needs to be a lot faster. As you can see, you kind of stand it up and then finish with the elbows at the last second here. So if I rewind it, watch your elbows. So here's locked out. And then there's still a slight lock right there before you bring the bar down. So we want it locked out right away. There shouldn't be any more pressing after the bar is overhead. Let's go and take a look at your split trick now. Same thing. The heels are rising right about as you're about to drive, which means that it, when you get stronger, the weight's going to go out in front of you. Or you're just going to miss the lift in general because the – or sorry, you're going to cut off some power because of uh, – the lack of contact here in the heels as the drive goes up. Overall, though, really good mechanics on the jerk. That was really good. So let's just work on keeping those heels down longer. And then jerk, you're going to roll forward a little bit, but wear your weightlifting shoes if you have to just to get into a, a good movement pattern so you know exactly how you want to dip. And let's focus on uh, locking out those elbows, being as snappy as possible in the jerk. Overall, great job, though.